So earlier this week, or in, during the lot, last podcast, actually, we did a segment on Redcoin and its potential as the uh, social currency being you know, tipped on Twitter and YouTube and Reddit and Facebook and such. And the video went viral uh, the following weekend and got over 8,000 views. And then on Tuesday, it was taken down by YouTube for violating the terms of service, supposedly, uh, for getting views. And they claimed that there were fake views on, on the video and re-uploaded it shortly after uh, with the view count put down back down to zero, uh, no more comments, uh, you know, no more stats or anything, just a brand new video copy of the original thing. So at, at, at first, we at CoinBrief thought that, um, you know, that, that all, all, all the views were real um, because that's, that's what it appeared to us. None of us, like, uh, set out any bots or anything we don't even know how to do that really to to generate fake views and we would just create new content anyway instead of trying to rack up fake views on an already made video but um uh so so what what new developments have happened um basically it's the views some of the views were fake and were embed or the video was embedded on malware sites or something uh yeah dustin the editor and co-founder of coin brief found out that um, he was like looking at some analytics uh, for the video yeah. and um, he saw some of the uh, some of the websites that our video got um, posted to uh, and they were like known um, websites they're known for like having uh, malicious content or like having malware on them or something. Mm. So um, what we think is that uh, uh, for whatever reason somebody wanted to take our video down or possibly get our channel suspended. Um, so they used some kind of bot or something to uh, get our video posted on all these shady websites to generate mm. all these artificial views mm. so we would violate the terms of service with YouTube. Yeah. Okay. So I um this this could go either way, right? This could be a malicious actor who wanted, you know, has a problem with us for some whatever reason and wanted to, you know, take one of our videos down, or it could be a fanatical uh, red coin like um, fan basically who wanted this to go viral even more and placed it on some some kind of some malware. Uh, like I, I what do you what do you call it? Like a fake fake views website or something. Some kind of bot. I don't know. Yeah. Um, so it did, it did happen, basically. Yeah. And uh, really, there's, we found out uh, Dustin started a thread in uh, Google support forums. I think that's what it's called. And uh, a couple people told us that there's actually, after they delete the video, there's like not really anything they can do. Um, the, YouTube really has no way of determining how many of the views were actually fake and how many were legitimate. Mm -hmm. So, um, mm -hmm. basically, if um, our video raises any red flags with the uh, automated um, video moderating system, it'll get taken down and we can't really do anything about it except file an appeal and then they'll put the video back up with – set everything back to zero. Yeah, so, yeah, know. okay. This is a, this has been a <laughs> this has been annoying a little bit during the past week. So let me let me like do a couple of like or one PSA kind of thing. So basically, anyone watching our podcast, our videos and stuff, um, like whether you support us or or don't like us, like it doesn't really matter. You're watching the video, so we're getting the views anyway. So it's it's great just having viewers. Um, but viewers who do like us don't don't like try and make the video go artificially viral you know um it'll it'll get traction on its own if it's good content then people will share it organically over social media and you know we we, we put these stories up obviously on youtube and we're going to start doing it on soundcloud as well the audio version on soundcloud and then also the video on vimeo as well because YouTube's policies are kind of whack. Um, mm -hmm. 
but yeah, like we we put this stuff out there like enough, and and on Reddit and 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 social media, Twitter and such, like it will get traction on its own. Don't worry. Um, trying to tr- to rack up fake views just looks desperate. Like it, it makes us look bad because it, it seems like we were we were the ones doing it when in actuality it was just some random person who either wanted to attack us or shoot red coins on the moon either way it's not um it's it's just not helpful you know so that's that's really that's my two cents on it yeah we we really want to build a and like a legitimate audience you know from the ground up and so we just really don't want um whether it's good intention whether it's like well intentioned or not we just Mm -hmm. don't want any artificial um we don't want any artificial uh publicity i guess you'd call it yeah and um and you know we don't we don't have any monetization on our videos right now so you know giving us artificial views doesn't really like make us any money or anything pretty much all it does is it it hurts us because um it it gets our video taken down and if it happens again you know our our, uh, channel could get uh suspended indefinitely Yeah. yeah so um so yeah yeah we just we just want to do it the right way yeah so that that would be great if um I mean we we just we have only a few viewers so far. Uh, Coin Brief, the YouTube channel has around 20 subscribers at this point. We've been gaining a couple every week, so we're making progress. But yeah, we we thank everyone who continues to watch us. Uh, the the real viewers, the humans watching, and you know please don't set out bots to artificially inflate the viewership. So yeah, thank you guys. Yep, and if you're doing it to hurt us, you're lame. <laughs> yeah, super lame. Super lame and get a life also. <laughs> make or make your own podcast. Try and compete with us. Yeah. Who cares? You know, or join us. I don't care. Free markets. Free markets. Yeah. Don't make try something and, better than us. 